Someone get the scientist in here now. We're in trouble. Big trouble. With the recent rollout of VK resistant squares, by finding an energy fluctuation at Loot Lake, we have confirmed that the IO are preparing something pretty dangerous down below Loot Lake. And by this all, the origin has also confirmed for himself that the paradigm isn't lying. And yes, it's also pretty much confirmed that it's Imagine Order's doomsday machine that they're preparing. Also, the doomsday machine they are preparing is another exploit IO are doing to the zero point itself by using its energy. And there is also a theory where the zero point as a singularity of all the omniverse also has a golden energy form. This was just a thing I needed to mention about the zero point. But the final update of the season arrives on May 17th bringing all the live event files and paradigm is coming soon after all these threats the seven and us have detected there is no way for her to not arrive and help and the imagine orders doomsday machine plan is going to be below loot lake so there are a lot chances of loot lake to collapse and form a waterfall crater like kind of it had in past. Maybe the mysteries below Loot Lake will be revealed too. And the Imagine Order's plan is definitely not the only thing to worry about. Now when we have spotted the energy fluctuation at Loot Lake, things hereby start spicing up. As soon as the final update of the season arrives, we will be on very final stage of pushing back IO boundaries on island. So, why does the origin doesn't believe paradigm? The origin believes that the paradigm took an inside help to escape a IO prison that origin himself couldn't. So that's the reason why origin does not trust paradigm. And recently in a 7 party, agent Jones was drunk and imagined asked him a lot questions about IO files and a lot related stuff which later seemed suspicious to Jones. Well, seems like we should wait and watch as we get closer to the final update. And rest stuff like that, I'll see you in the next one. Yep.